What is going on you guys? Welcome back to a brand new YouTube video. If you're new here, my name is Ryder and today we will be doing the legendary 10,000 calorie challenge. I've been wanting to do this for a while. I'm pretty excited to do it. I love food. I love donuts. I love pizza. I love all that crap. But now I'm starting to get a little nervous. We're about to hop into it though with one of my favorites. How else will we start this challenge without some Dunkin' Donuts, baby? So we're about to go through, get a 12 pack, head back to the house, dive in. You know what we got to get. We got to get two Boston creams. We got to get two strawberry frosted two chocolate frosted and probably can get the rest random assortment just because i like surprises baby donuts secured let's head to the house and dive in baby let's get it started oh yeah first we got to weigh in that's what we're gonna be looking like that's my physique that's what we're gonna do with my physique out the window so let's weigh in right here see what we're looking like 172.2 boom so keep in mind, I do have joggers on too, so I'm probably like 171-ish. So we're gonna weigh in at the end of the challenge too, see how many pounds I actually put on. And uh, so it's about to get nasty, man. Look what we have here, my friends. We have 12 assorted donuts that are gonna blow me up like a blowfish. We have two jelly fields, two chocolate frosted, two strawberry frosted, two Boston cream. So those are my like top favorite donuts. And then I told them random assortment because I like surprises. So it looks like they put some pretty trash donuts in here. Um, just probably, they didn't care. They just probably pulling the random crap in there. So we're about to dive head first in here. Comment down below, what is your favorite donut? <laughs> Damn! Strawberry Frost is the best donut in the game. You can't tell me wrong. Next up, we got the Boston Cream, baby. It's a legend of its own. Look at that creaminess. Is it focus, Reese? Can they see that creaminess in there? Again. Okay. Do you want one, Reese? Damn, that's good. I don't think I can do this. Uh, it started off strong. Now I'm just like, stomach's kind of hurting. I'm pretty miserable. The final bite right here, we're gonna wrap it up. I'm gonna save these donuts for later, but uh, I'm feeling pretty bad. Ugh. Carly's on the screen. So I was only able to eat five donuts, but I feel like I'm about to throw up right now. We gotta keep pushing, baby. Moving on to the next meal. Just get a large meat lover's pan pizza. And that doesn't come with garlic on the crust, does it? No, sir. Okay, perfect. Your total is $21.79, and it's gonna be about 15 to 25 minutes till it's ready. Thank you. You're welcome. $21? Bro, something has to be wrong with this. $21 for a pizza? Jesus Christ, man. $21. All right, something has to get fixed about this situation. Googled the highest calorie pizza and it was the Meat Lovers Pan Pizza. It's like 470 calories or something crazy like that for each slice. So I'm about to go in here and get it. She tried to charge me $21. I knew that couldn't be right. They always try to overcharge you a pizza. So I had to call her back and say, hey, I want the deal. So it's like 14 bucks, it's still too high, but we're about to go in here, get this za and head to the crib and tear it up man pizza time baby this right here this is a box of diabetes like i said i got the highest calorie pizza that pizza hut has 470 calories per slice man the deep dish or whatever this is look at the grease on there just dripping i have acne screaming tomorrow pretty good pizza it feels like i'm just eating grease I might as well just get a bowl of grease, pour it back, and then eat some bread with it. <clears throat> a little update, I am on my fourth piece right now. This is probably the worst that I've ever felt in my entire life. I'm very sleepy today. My brain's like... <laughs> <laughs> it's sleepy. That sounds, that sounds kitty-ish. <laughs> yeah, no one cares about your flipping tired life. 
Dessert time, baby. I've earned it. So I've, I feel like I've got throw up like right here and it's just a matter of time before I explode. So we're, we're about to uh, get this Boston cream and it's gonna explode in my mouth. You can do it, Ryder. You can do it, kid. Hmm. Time to keep trucking, baby. I gotta keep moving. I can't stay sitting down. I like after you eat all those calories, you just want to like lay down. You feel stuffed. You feel lazy. Oh, you gotta keep moving, man. You gotta stay active. Keep burning them off as best as you can. Moving on to a little pre-workout snack. I'm craving something sweet. I'm feeling like crap. So let's go get some of my favorite cookies, man. Can I just get a medium animal cracker blizzard. All right, ladies and gentlemen, what we have right here, like I said, my favorite cookies. Bam. The sugar cookies. Uh, they only had like this yellow or green. I don't know, I'm colorblind, but they only had this color. And I'm pretty iffy on this. I like the pink, the white, but all the colors are pretty good. So we're going to eat these. These are 160 calories per cookie. So I'm pretty sure I can down nearly the entire pack. And then we've got a frosted animal cracker blizzard. I've been wanting to try these bad boys. So now's the time. So in this is 1,030 calories, crazy. And then we got a small fry because I was craving some fries, man. Ooh, check that out. Damn! That thing's hitting, man. Comment down below, what's your favorite blizzard? I'm a blizzard fanatic, man. I love animal crackers. Look at the little animal crackers in there. Fries, give them a little Dunkaroo in there. Dairy Queen definitely has the best fries out there, man. Nobody can tell me different. Dairy Queen, the best fast food fries. Sugar cookie, man. Golly, I love you, baby. I underestimated this. I thought I could take down the cookies. I've taken down four so far, about to finish the blizzard, finish the fries. So, uh, I don't know my, how much more I can do. Pre-workout meal complete. I'll put the calories on the screen so we got to eat a good bit of food tonight. So we're about to take some pre-workout, get stemmed out of our minds, and hit a workout, baby. Woo! Gym time, baby! Let's get stemmed out! We got some amps up right here, bomb sickle, baby. You know what I've been rocking with? I've been rocking with this every day since this came out. It's my favorite flavor yet. You can use my code RIDER. Save you 10% off, man. Ever since this flavors came out, I haven't dry scooped since just because it tastes that good. So I sip on it with some water and it absolutely makes me just like skin crawl. I'm ready to F up the weights, man. After you drink this, it's a bad day to be a weight. Damn! Pre-workout cookie. Now we're ready. Let's freaking go, man. I'm hyped up. It's a big, big shoulder day. We're gonna be focusing on the shoulders today, just strictly shoulders, maybe sprinkling a little, little back, but we're gonna be blowing up the cannons, freaking making them cap shoulders. Jacob's behind the camera. He wasn't gonna come to the gym again. I had to talk him into coming. Are you excited, man? Are you excited? I'm excited, man. Let's freaking get it, man. <laughs> big shoulder day, let's go. Consistency is the key. Consistency, man. Consistency. Everybody wants instant gratitude. That shit don't happen, man. Put you about three years in to relax after that. Let's get it. We're about to blow up the shoulders, man. We got three dumbbells right here. We're going to be doing louder raises. 12, drop them. 8, drop them. 6, and on the last one, we're going to hold it at a 30 degree angle and just let that thing marinate. And <laughs> it's going to be on fire, man. Let's get it. <laughs>
having a shoulder press off, man. I just called him up. That's what He's trying to call me out over here, man. It's all about the looks, not how much you can do. I'm dead, too. I'm dead. I'm worn out. No, he got you. I don't know how this is about to go. Just, just do one. See. Let's get this work. Slap him up. I just said eight. You did eight. I try to double. Oh shit. He's calling me out, man. Gotta be doing them full reps though, man. What you mean? The full reps all the way down, all the way down, man. There we go. Yeah. I'm getting a little harder now. Yeah, you gotta make them touch. Come on, man. Ah, uh, you ain't yet 16. You might not even get eight. Let's go. How many are there? Six. It's the same way with bench. That's what I always tell you. When you pull bench, you ain't got to touch. But doing it that way, it do feel. Yeah. See, because you'll you go down. Rest, babe. We don't have rep, man. You'll go down and you'll go up. See, I'm used to making them clap. I don't make them clap, boy. I only make them clap. <laughs> To work out together. Let's eat, man. It's time to get these 80s. There you go. Enough talk. A lot of people can't do that. I got you just in case. Just in case. Good money. He put me up to a challenge. Whoever do the least amount of reps with the heaviest weight. That's right. Yeah. The loser has to do 30 push ups. Loser gonna do 30. And triceps just happen to be my strongest muscle, baby. We're gonna see. Well, we let's go. Let's see. Well, let's go. Wait the time. We can go let's right, go. right now. Let's, let's go. Let's We're about to see. Duh. Two. Uh, Three. Uh, uh, messing up the phone. Uh, messing up the phone. Uh, you got eight right shit. there. You got eight. He hopped straight to the 200. You got eight. He's been doing arms, so he's warmed up. I just hopped straight to the 200. What do you say? I hopped straight to the 200, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I ain't changing no way. You've been doing arms, though. So that ought to be ought to be weaker, right? Nah, you should be warm. <clears throat> oh, you putting your whole you putting your whole upper body into it, man. Huh? Not no. Show him that video so he can see how he was. How you want me to do it? All right, go ahead, man. Goodness, I'm pressing, right? He like tried to slow me down. Your body into it, man. Huh? Like you're shoving your upper body into it. You ain't see your whole head over the way. Mm. Straight up, right? Mm. All the way up. Mm. Hey. Uh. Uh. Hey. Uh. 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 U
So what you're gonna do for a perfect taco, evenly spread the mild sauce down the taco to get that perfect taco. <sighs> Damn! You can go to the fanciest Mexican restaurant and I promise you it will not beat this taco from Taco Bell. All right, Taco Bell finish. I'm to the point now where I can't stop. If I stop, I fill up. So I just gotta keep the ball rolling, man. We gotta keep it going. We got these bad boys again. I think I'm gonna have diabetes tomorrow. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have reached the final meal of the night. This is gonna push me just over the 10K, the, the 10K calorie <laughs> mark. Yeah, we have a hefty bowl of Frosted Flakes that could feed a whole village right here. We have our last donut. We have some little bites and we have this massive um, cupcake that'll... <laughs> <laughs> Stop! This is ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a cupcake, it's a muffin. It's not that good. I'm gonna need some recovery after this. My body has been beaten to a pulp today. The final muffin. It all comes down to this, man. Alright, physique check, boys. Feeling pretty bloated. So we're about to see what we're looking like. 177, not too bad. So we were like 171 this morning, so 177, but feeling terrible, feeling bloated. Today is the most food that I've ever ate in one day. It was like a crazy amount. I just feel terrible. My skin feels awful. My energy's down and my motivation is just down. So tomorrow, like I said, I'm gonna have to take it easy, get back on track with your food. So when you have a hefty cheat meal or cheat day, the next day, just get back on track, get into your normal routine, drink a lot of water and fast if you need to, so you don't bloat up when you eat. If you enjoyed the video, hit the subscribe button. It helps me out, especially me looking in the mirror now and just throwing my physique out the window. Comment down below, hit the like button. I appreciate you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.